The Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 is an addition to the Amplatzer Vascular Plug family providing single device solutions for optimal peripheral embolization. This low profile device is designed for arterial and venous embolization in the peripheral vasculature and is delivered through an 038 diagnostic catheter. This program provides information on the Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 components, evaluation and sizing of the occlusion site, preparation for delivery, and the placement procedure. Please refer to the instructions for use for complete indications and usage, contraindications, warnings, and precautions. The Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 is a self-expanding nitinol mesh occlusion device consisting of two fine mesh tapered lobes. The radiopaque markers are located at the proximal and distal ends of the device. A microscrew attachment at the proximal end of the AVP4 attaches to a nitinol delivery wire for delivery and release. The AVP4 is shipped attached to a 155 centimeter delivery wire in a hoop dispenser. The device is preloaded in a loader. A plastic vise is also included and may be attached to the delivery wire to facilitate device detachment. The tip of the loader is a spring-loaded tapered tube that engages the diagnostic catheter and cannot be detached from the loader assembly. The Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 is ideal for embolization procedures, particularly through torturous vasculature and in distal anatomy. The delivery wire is designed with a floppy 20-centimeter distal section to allow it to track easily through torturous anatomy. The overall low profile of the device enables it to pass through an 038 diagnostic catheter for ease of use. The use of a diagnostic catheter also eliminates the need for catheter exchange. The Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 is available in five sizes, represented by the diameter of the device. All sizes of the AVP4 are delivered through a four or five French 038 guide wire compatible diagnostic catheter. Please refer to the Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 instructions for use and diagnostic catheter product labeling to ensure proper catheter selection. Accurate sizing of the targeted vessel is important to ensure optimal closure and to prevent device embolization. Prep the patient following standard practice for vascular access and vessel occlusion. Access the vessel and perform an angiogram at the targeted occlusion site. Carefully measure the vessel diameter at the site. Observe the vessel to ensure the occlusion site has sufficient length so the deployed Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 will not obstruct other vessels or anatomical structures. The selected Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 should be approximately 30 to 50 percent larger than the target vessel diameter. Ensure the 038 guide wire compatible diagnostic catheter has adequate wall strength to accommodate the delivery of the Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4 to the occlusion site and is less than or equal to 100 centimeters in length. The AVP4 has been tested for compatibility with the following diagnostic catheters. The 5 French Boston Scientific Imager 2, the 4 French Cordis Tempo, the 4 French Cordis Tempo Aqua, and the 5 French Merit Medical Impress. The use of other diagnostic catheters may result in an inability to deliver, deploy, or recapture the device. Refer to the manufacturer's instructions for use of these diagnostic catheters, as the manufacturer may make changes without notice that may impact the suitability for use with our Amplatzer Vascular Plug 4. Connect a 10cc syringe of sterile saline to the stopcock and flush the loader and device until sterile saline exits the distal tip of the loader through the device. Do not advance or retract the device from the loader without attaching the loader to a catheter hub. Leave the device in the loader. If the device is accidentally deployed, grasp the spring-loaded tapered loader tubing and the rotating lure in one hand and retract the delivery wire 
with the other hand. Continue to retract the delivery wire until both the single white marker and the double white marker on the delivery wire are visible. Reflush the device if necessary. Remove the loader and the delivery wire from the hoop dispenser. Insert the tapered tip of the loader into the hub of the diagnostic catheter. Press the rotating lure to the hub of the catheter and rotate clockwise to ensure full engagement of the loader to the catheter hub. Do not connect the rotating lure through a stopcock, hemostasis valve, Y connector, or other valve. This will result in damage to the loader. Open the stopcock to allow blood backflow to remove all air from the diagnostic catheter and loader. Close the stopcock. Advance the device into the 038 guide wire compatible diagnostic catheter until the double white marker is at the hemostasis valve. This indicates that the floppy distal section is completely contained inside the catheter. Remove the loader if desired. Advance the Amplatzer vascular plug 4 up to the diagnostic catheter distal tip. Do not twist or rotate the delivery wire during advancement. If rotation is required, rotate the diagnostic catheter along with the delivery wire. Adjust the diagnostic catheter position if required to ensure the distal end of the device will deploy at the distal edge of the occlusion site. Stabilize the delivery wire and gently pull back the diagnostic catheter to deploy the AVP4 in the vessel. The device should expand to completely oppose the vessel wall. Use the radiopaque markers to evaluate the position of the AVP4. If the position is not satisfactory, recapture the AVP4 by stabilizing the delivery wire and advancing the diagnostic catheter back over the device until the device is at least partially within the catheter. Reposition and redeploy. When the Amplatzer vascular plug 4 position is satisfactory, attach the plastic vise to the delivery wire. Stabilize the diagnostic catheter and rotate the delivery wire counterclockwise until it separates from the device. Retract the delivery wire into the diagnostic catheter and remove from the patient. Complete the procedure following standard technique.